we're going to do 5k minus k over j minus 2j over 3k. And the first thing we need to do is give all of those a common denominator. So starting with our 5k here, we're going to multiply that by 3jk over 3jk, since those are the denominators of our other fractions. And then that's going to give us 15jk squared over 3jk. So now we'll look at our k over j and multiply that by 3k over 3k. And that'll give us 3k squared over 3jk. And our last fraction there is 2j over 3k. And we need to multiply that by j over j. And that'll give us 2j squared over 3jk. Now we can take our original problem, which was 5k minus k over j minus 2j over 3k, and rewrite it as 15jk squared over 3jk minus 3k squared over 3jk. minus 2j squared over 3jk. And now that those all have a common denominator, we can put them all in one fraction, giving us 15jk squared minus 3k squared minus 2j squared all over 3jk. And since there's nothing we can factor out of the top, this is our simplified answer.